competition is fierce today. We've seen such magnificent performers, but the show hasn't ended yet. We still have a lot more contestants, so please help me welcoming the next contestant on the Shia board. Here I pray, my heart full of your love, and I... My name is Alamda Musi. Mashallah. Where have you come from, brother? I'm, I've come from Tor Toronto, Canada. I'll be taking a uh, category in Latmiya uh, Manqabat. Me, my job is to uh, recite for the Ahlul Bayt, to spread the to spread Ahlul Bayt all over. You've come all the way from Canada. What made you come all the way from Canada to recite on the Shia voice? Uh, many, uh, many young people are inspired by me and so I want to inspire them to send the message of Ahlul Bayt all over the world. Best of luck and we look forward to listening to your Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum as wa rahmatullah. You're gonna get any closer? No. <laughs> you jump on stage here? <laughs> your name? My name is Alamdar Musavi. Alamdar Musawi. MashaAllah, Alamdar. And uh, you're based where? I'm from Canada, Toronto. From Canada, Toronto. Okay, what's your local Imam Barga? Al Mahdi Islamic Center. Al Mahdi Islamic Center, MashaAllah. How many years have you been reciting? Uh, since the age of six. Okay, and you're what, 13 now? Yes. So, seven years? Yep. How do you maintain this passion? Did you ever think, oh, you know what, I don't want to do this anymore? Uh, the thing is, I was into the dhikr of the Ahlul Bayt. And Ma so I had fun doing, with, doing Ma the dhikr. MashaAllah. And you recite in Muharram as well? Yes. Mainly? Um, okay, very well done. Your favorite reciters, apart from Sayyid Maysam Abbas next to me? Uh, it's uh, Mir Hassan Mir. Mir Hassan Mir, MashaAllah. What will you be reciting tonight? Uh, today I will be reciting a Naat about Prophet Muhammad. Naat. Can you translate Naat into not English? basically, it's kind of manqabat. Can you translate manqabat into English? <laughs> <laughs> not. Manqabat, basically a not. happy poetry. Happy poetry, okay. But all right, brilliant. Happy poetry on this wonderful occasion. Welcome him with a round of applause. My dad, my grandfather used to recite. And so I found out that because uh, in a few years ago, I found out that, but my dad used to read. And so like, I, it, it sounds so good reciting for the dhikr of Ahlul Bayt. And so I, I kind of got interested into it. And so when I started reciting, I felt into the love, loveliness of the Ahlul Bayt. Ya Muhammad Ya Muhammad Ya Muhammad Ya Muhammad Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 
بس اللہ یا محمد میں جلتی دھوپ میں جب چھیڑ دی نہ تیر سور میں جلتی دھوپ میں جب چھیڑ دی نہ تیر سور رحمتوں کی ہر طرف ایسی گھٹا چھائی کہ بس یا محمد حبیبی حبیبی انتا دیکھ ابھی وقت ہے دامان احمد تھامنے دیکھ ابھی وقت ہے دامان احمد تھامنے The dhikr of Ahlul Bayt gives you joy, heedfulness, and so I recommend people to listen to speeches, manqabats, and poetry, and Quran recitation, and feel the joyfulness of what the meaning is. Habibi, where do I start? ولا نزار حبيبي حيدر حيدر beautiful recitation you know since last season I was saying play in your area you are playing in your area your area is very tiny very not very wide you are not going very high or coming down no no how to say very يعني ضيق yeah, very tiny, but you are play, playing very well because that's your area. Look, the recitation of the Manqabat was beautiful. You conveyed the emotional contents of the piece with real passion and feeling. You are Noha Khan. Lot of Noha Khan comes here with mobile phone. I tell them why you recite from mobile, mo mobile phone. <laughs> you have your, your own notebook with you. How Masha old is, okay, can you tell me how old is that notebook? Oh, I've been having this since the age of six. This is right, this is right. That's Habibi the right way. Allah. Excellent. Sayyid Ahmad. No, I just want to say, listen, that was remarkable. That was so soothing. It's soothing. That's the, the right problem, way. it was so soothing, it could put you to sleep, you know, and we have to try and stay awake here. It's just unbelievable. Where have you been this whole time? I'm so, so happy that you're here. Yep. And I'm so, so honored to be on a stage um, next to you. Well done, young Ahsan, man. Well, Ahsan, say it. Mason? 
Uh, yeah, you guys stole my comments. Soothing. And I wish there wasn't a timer today. I wish you could have just kept reciting the whole night. And I think uh, it's so befitting that Shabi Miraj and you were reciting about this Nath. I was actually kind of scared for you when you first started because I I had an idea that you were going to pick this one when you said Nath and and you said Meera Sadmeed and you and you pulled it out. It's out, written by Agha Sarosh. This is, uh, I, don't, I would say, even the most professional reciters don't pick this one because it's, it's very, it's very uh, scary for them. Even for myself, I wouldn't pick this one when I go. This wouldn't be my first choice. And for you to have done this so easily, maneuvering so effortlessly, I, I want to drop the English. Anyway, cool. Uh, Say Jalan, they have mentioned all the good points. You have, mashallah, many good points. But I think I want you to, inshallah, sort for next recitation when you are doing. Number one, the name of the Holy Prophet is Muhammad. Of course, you in Urdu, you pronounce it Muhammad. Try to, to, to work on this. Muhammad in every language should be pronounced properly, nicely. Even, for example, in Spanish, they say Mahoma, but we have to say Muhammad, for example, yes? Or oh, Ali, yeah, the Ain. That is the thing, inshallah, you have to work. Another thing, this way you were reciting, it, we call it shadow of your voice. Shadow Very of your point. voice. It's yes. not your actual voice. Yes. Yes? You have to try as well to show the actual voice, try to work more on your chest. Of course, you are in a very critical age, but try to show the actual voice. You were reciting in the shadow of your voice. It was beautiful. I enjoyed. Thank you. Ahsan Sajjan. Lastly, we go to Muhammad Abbas Karim. Thank you, Ahsan. That was absolutely amazing. Um, I heard you recite in JCC uh, the Noha earlier this year, and I thought, you know, absolutely phenomenal recitation. What a difficult kalam he chose, Ya Muhammad. Uh, Afwan. <laughs> and what a, what a difficult kalam. Um, I usually won't recite it because it's so difficult, but like me, somebody did. You did a really good job. Keep it up. And I know how powerful your voice is. Your noha is amazing. You've got a really bright future. Excellent. Well done. Mashallah. Ascent. Ascent. All the way from Canada, Haidar. <laughs> Citation. How are you feeling after the audition and the, the judgment that the judges have said to you? I feel good. Yeah. Anything else? No. What are you currently feeling? I was here to do the dhikr of Ahlul Bayt. MashaAllah. And I completed it. Amazing. Amazing. Well, uh, best of luck, inshallah. We look forward to seeing what's to come, inshallah. Aydar al Mosawi. Alamdar al Mosawi. MashaAllah. I feel happy, I feel, I feel good. Feel excited? Yeah. And tell me, you know, what are you going to carry on doing to make sure that you make it through to that final? Uh, I, would, I would solve my, my mistakes that the judges have said.